Sanders campaign, Tad Devine. You know, when I look at the number for Hillary of vulnerability, the fact is 27% is not a great number of right. trust. Why didn't your guy jump on the email thing? Let me put it this way. Why did he give it away? Why didn't he just say, you know what, I'm, not, I'm tired of hearing about the damn thing. Why didn't he just let it lie there, let the Republicans and the FBI do their thing? Why did he pull it back out of action? Because he Give does. her a break on that. Well, I don't know if he gave her a break. I mean, he sure he did. Well, listen, look, look what the Republicans did in Benghazi, okay? They gave her a lift. <laughs> I know, I know. You didn't have to, no, you're making, yeah, yeah. don't fight me on something I didn't say. I would say shove it down yeah, her throat. Sure. I'd say, let her deal with the problem yeah. of the emails. I'll, it's I'll, not his problem. Sure, I'll tell you why. Because Bernie Sanders is convinced that if we have a real debate on issues that voters care about, he's going to win this election. That's why. And if we have debates about other issues that they don't care as much about, his chances of winning are diminished. Okay, you're still not making a point. Let the other people attack her on that. You attack her on the ideological stuff he wants to hit her on. Well, he wants to, he wants to debate real issues. Listen, yeah. they have big differences on how do we, you know, college education. He thinks it should be universal. We shouldn't stop at high school. We should go through college. She has another plan. Let's debate it. And if we have to be on guns, issues. on guns, listen, Bernie Sanders. He's earned, not as, as strong as she is on guns right now. He, he, he earned his D minus lifetime rating from the NRA. He's opposed assault weapons since he lost his first election over that issue in 1988. He he called for closing the gun show loophole. He thinks we should have a limit on the size of cartridges. He's, you know, everything in her ad today, yeah. he supports. Okay, so listen, she wants to have a debate about that. He wants to have a debate about this. Why America has a rigged economy that's held in place by a corrupt system of campaign finance, okay? And, and we're happy to Do you, you know, accept it? Did you do a poll piece? out that most people now believe that Congress, that most members, look at this, 52% of Americans say most members of Congress are corrupt. Is that yeah. something Bernie believes? Corrupt I, members I, of Congress, he, he the be majority. He believes that our system right now of campaign finance is corrupt, okay? And it's the centerpiece of his campaign right now, talking about how he would, and by the way, that's why he's not participating. Is Hillary corrupt for taking super PAC no, money? No, he, you know, he's Well, he's she's not, taking super PAC and not taking it, but he, it's helping her. He has denounced a corrupt system, and super PACs are a big part of it. And I think Our candidates who rely on super PACs corrupt. He, he's not going to call her corrupt, and he's not going to call our her Our candidates like who rely on super PAC help corrupt, because uh, uh, he's not accepting it. No, he, listen, it, it, Bernie's not going to engage in a campaign of name calling. What he will do is is you know call out a system which is broken, totally broken down. And it's and that system is holding place holding in place a rigged economy that's sending all the wealth to the top. That's what his campaign's about. And I think he's gonna go through and listen, Hillary's doing better in, in New Hampshire. I'll stipulate to that. I will also say she's had three months of unanswered television. Okay? Yeah. And we're gonna start you just tomorrow with our message. two million bucks up there right Yeah now. we're we're gonna start tomorrow in Iowa and New Hampshire. And I think when people get to know Bernie Sanders story, it's a powerful story. It's something that's gonna resonate. It's an American story, okay, that yeah. begins at the Statue of Liberty. And I think when people hear it and they understand his accomplishments as mayor, as congressman and senator, they're going to understand. And by the way, that's why in your own poll that came out today, he's doing better against Rubio. He's doing better against if, Trump uh, than Hillary he, Clinton. If he gets the nomination of the Democratic Party for president, will he become a Democrat? He is. A, he's running as a Democrat. Right? He is, no, no is, he a Demo is he a member yes, of the Democratic he Party? Well, he's, he can't be a, technically a member of the party because there's no party registration in Vermont. But when he signs, Is he a Democrat? Yes, he's running as I a Democrat. I think he's a socialist. Which is it? Well, he's, his philosophy is Democratic socialist. Oh, his title was socialist no, because he, he's an independent he's not, caucus. He, he's, always, he's an independent member of the Democratic caucus in the Senate, sure. but he's not a Democratic member of the caucus. He's a member of the Democratic caucus. He's but he's not a Democrat. Democrats. He's running as a Democrat for president of the United States. He <laughs> so signed, he is a Democrat. He signed an affidavit. Okay, I, I, I first time I heard that. Says I, don't don't argue with me. It's a weird situation. Yeah, he's uh, now a Democrat well, because in the past he's ran against Democrats for the Senate, sure, ran agree. against Democrats for, yeah. for mayor, ran against Democrats for That's Congress. Right. In this campaign, he decided to run for the Democratic Party nomination. He's running as a Democrat. He is a Democrat. Yes. Okay. I'm glad we resolved well, that. Well, I didn't know he changed parties. He's he didn't change parties. There's no, if, it, if he could register, he would, but he can't. <laughs> Okay. I think that's a technical point. I, I'll take him at his word. He's a socialist, which is fine He's with me. He's a democratic me. socialist. Okay. Well, Let's that's, get that that's straight. Fair. Let's go okay, with that good. one. That's a nice right. mix there. Thank you, Tad Devine. <laughs> Keeper of the keys.